Hi there, good afternoon and welcome to your most trusted sports channel on YouTube, El Achilokun, the writer. Just as we did in the morning in terms of the player ratings for the Black Stars of Ghana in their game against the Super Green Eagles of Nigeria, we are doing the same for the Super Eagles um, in terms of how their players rated in the game. So just as you know, the Super Eagles of Nigeria held the Black Stars of Ghana 0-0 drawn game at the Kumasi Barbera Sports Stadium on Friday night in the 2022 FIFA World Cup qualifiers. Simon Moses should have drawn first blood for the Super Eagles on a 56 minute mark when he watched his goal bound effort block off by the Ghana goalkeeper Joseph Wolakot. Glasgow Rangers midfielder Joe Aribo won the midfield battle over Arsenal Thomas Party. Oyenka Kamil with a dangerous closing, twisting, and turning swerve move that got the heart of Ghanaian fans at the stadium in their mouth. Now we take a look at how the various players rated for the Super Eagles. Frank Izoho, the Omonia Nicosia shortstopper, pulled a world class stop to deny Fatawi Siaku in the 37th minute of the game. He made a couple of decent saves in the area to keep the Super Eagles on a clean sheet going to the return fixture fixed for March 29, 2022 at the Masood Abiola Sports Stadium in Abuja. He organized the backline very well and as you know, he stepped in for the first choice goalkeeper Maduka Okoye, Zaidu Sanusi, rated 6 out of 10. Sanusi police Jordan Ayu for the 92 minutes, the Crystal Palace striker lasted on a field of play. Um, he was extra careful with the Crystal Palace forward as he committed minimum fouls against him and ensured he didn't create any dangerous moment for the visitors. So as a result, he is rated 6 out of 10. William Truss Ecom, the Super Eagles captain, put up his A game to hold the tireless Airs Roma starlet Felix Afenajan at bay. The 19 year was eager to cause problems for the Super Eagles, but he was kept under control. Uh, most time by the Dutch born defender, including a crucial interception which saw the defender head the ball far away from the path of the unrushing youngster who has his eyes firmly fixed at goal. Leon Balagon, a compatriot of Ecom in central defense, the pair worked decently well to curtail a workaholic gunning attack led by the Airs Roma Starlet as Nigeria maintain a clean sheet going into um, the second leg fixture um, next Tuesday. We come into midfield and we start off with Bonke Innocent or Innocent Bonke um, who replaced or who was replaced by Peter Itebo just after the armor. Prior to his frustration, the lower midfielder combined with Joe Aribo to beat Thomas Partey to the midfield battle as Ghana failed to take advantage of a central midfield position. Now we look at Joe Aribo himself who was rated 6 out of 10. He was skillful, strong and commanding. The midfielder caused problems for Thomas Partey in midfield. He was athletic and creative in the mid. He was replaced just before the hour mark by Frank Oyeka, a stopper midfielder who later toyed with the Ghana defense uh, in the game. Kalechi Inhianacho or Kalechi Inhianacho as most Nigerians will say, he worked well to keep the attacking shape of the Nigerian team, mostly flirting around the attacking areas of the Ghana team, playing as a decoy to draw away the Ghanaian defensive rear guard for the wingers to explore his on the wings. And one of such instances led to a glaring goal scoring opportunity for Samuel Kuchukweze, who fired wide from an unmarked position inside the box. Simon Moses, 5 out of 10 started with a straight mark speed game one and had a good opportunity on the 12 minute mark when he resisted the challenge from midfield before bursting up with some good pace he should have scored the first goal of the game for nigeria 11 minutes after the interval when he was played through by kalechi hianacho but he saw his ball saved by ghana goalkeeper who plays in the fourth division of english football for swindon town he was replaced by lukman adimola on the 74th minute mark in the game now the next player on the bill is victor osimen victor osimen was one of the players that the Ghanaians rated as one of the most dangerous players who was going to cause problems for the nigerian defense but he came came close to poking the opening goal for nigeria in the early embers of the game after beating alexander jiku and daniel amate to the ball but after that he was pocketed by a Ghanaian central defensive pairing. Samuel Chukweze also replaced later on in the game. Teammate Emmanuel Days. Uh, Nigeria's first 
chance at goal fell to the Villarreal but he failed to seize the moment as he blasted his effort wide of the mark. After that, Denis Odoi showed him few of the ball until he was replaced by Emmanuel Denis of Watford. So we now look at the substitutes and how they were rated in the match. We look at Emmanuel Denis who came off as a replacement for Samuel Chukweze was rated 5.5 out of 10. Frank Onyeka, Frank Onyeka, fantastic super midfielder, was rated 6 out of 10. Peter Etebo scored 5 out of 10. Kevin Bassi of Glasgow Rangers scored 5. 5 out of 10 and Lukman Adimula of Leicester City score out of 10 on that particular occasion so this is why we draw the curtains down on the ratings of the Super Eagles in their first leg of the final run of the 2022 FIFA World Cup qualifiers um, game against the Black Stars of Ghana at the Barbara Sports Stadium on Friday night um, if you're in a GNA and you're watching this you have to feel proud of your national team because your team really really played a good game yesterday at the Barbaria Sports Stadium and I have to say that they should have taken the opportunity of all the chances that they created especially in the second half to punish the Black Stars but they couldn't take advantage of, of that but there's still the second leg to be played at the Mashoud Abia Sports Studio in um, Abuja on the 29th of March 2022 which is next week Tuesday stay tuned share this video comment subscribe to the channel and make sure that it trends on social media for your friends your family your acquaintances to be able to also see this exciting video as well thank you very much until we meet again stay blessed